To Hinesburg, Vermont we go. Rematch of that 2017 state championship game between the Raiders and the Red Hawks. Off the Rutland miss early, Cole Otley takes it in transition, coast to coast, up and in for the layup, CVU out to an early 3-2 lead. But the reigning champs have a response. Ethan Knott spots up from the corner, cash money, caps off a 5-0 Raiders spurt. Red Hawks try their luck from three off the mark, but there's Mason Otley there to clean it up inside. The Raiders look strong Saturday afternoon, though. Jacob Lorman, nice feed inside. Kyle Del Bianco in the paint for the hoop and the harm. Later on, Lorman takes it himself. Splash City from the corner. And the Raiders travel to Heinsberg and take home the W, 61-54. Hop on over to nearby South Burlington, Northeastern Clinton Cougars crossing the lake to visit the Rice Green Knights. Pick it up in the fourth quarter. Cougars add to their lead. Abby Racine off the glass and in. It's 33-27. The Green Knights had a comeback in them. Kristen Varen from long range. Splash. Then Fiona Connolly for three from nearly the same spot. We're tied at 39. Seconds winding down in this one. Rice with a chance to win the ball game. Khadija Hussein gets a clean look at it, but it's too strong and we head to overtime. In the extra period, Kaya McComb takes it right down Broadway, lays it up and in, and NCCS wins the Cross Lake Showdown in overtime, 47-43. More girls hoops, this time at Buckhard Gym. Burlington Seahorses hosting Mount Anthony. Second quarter, Patriots deploy their sharpshooters. Kat Worthington, worthy of that three. Then Caroline Mazinski, Mount Anthony, takes the lead. The Seahorses can hit from long range as well. Ella DeSellis spots up for the corner. Give her one, two, three of those. Then come on in, the bank is open for Emma Larravee. Back-to-back triples puts Burlington up at the break. But in the third quarter, the Patriots make their run. Grace Mahar takes the handoff in the lane, up and in for the deuce. Next possession, Mahar back for more. And the Patriots use a big second half to cruise to a 47-36 victory.